This week in West Virginia, Governor Jim Justice made a special stop to make the season brighter for some children in need. One, two, three. Dressed as Santa, the governor and first lady visited Chamberlain Elementary last Saturday to pass out hundreds of Christmas gifts to toddlers, kids, and teens. Governor Justice also announced that, with the help of several state officials and local community leaders, West Virginia has reached an agreement with the state of Maryland to continue marked train service in the eastern panhandle. Deputy Chief of Staff Ann Erling joined officials with the U.S. Department of Justice to announce the award of nearly $38 million to fight crime and improve community safety in West Virginia. First Lady Kathy Justice moderated a spelling bee with fourth and fifth grade students at Rupert Elementary School in Greenbrier County. Well, we're just so involved in the schools around the state. We want to come and see what the children do, and we were invited to come, and we just couldn't pass this up. Anytime we're invited to come to schools, that's what we do. And the West Virginia National Guard's Mountaineer Challenge Academy graduated 148 cadets who will go on to join the workforce, join the military, or seek higher educational training. You can find more on these stories and many others in the West Virginia Week in Review newsletter.